A lot of parents in Montana have concerns about some proposed changes to schools in the state. Those changes include how many librarians and counselors are required in schools, as well as changes to elective programs like music and art. Q2's David Jay has more on what's being considered. The Office of Public Instruction updates the state's administrative rules about every 10 years. An OPI spokesman says this is to help with quality education. And there are some concerns with some of the proposed changes. Montana, I'm a school librarian, I'm a social studies educator, and a parent of two kids in our public schools. Um, I do not support any of these changes. As a librarian, I see value in what we do every day. In the school, I see value in what our counselors do every day. The meeting started with 15 minutes of public comment that was later extended. Parents weighing in as a normally obscure committee gathered Wednesday to discuss school accreditation standards. Nearly all of them voicing concerns about potential changes for librarians and counselors, as well as changing the education requirements for arts and music. Many schools, especially rural districts, have struggled to hire teachers. Changes being proposed by Superintendent of Public Education, Elsie Arnton, would eliminate the ratio for school counselors to students. Currently, it's 400 to 1 and eliminate the requirement that schools also have a librarian. Education requirements for music and art would be left up to the local school boards. The terminology of elective, really in elementary school, you don't get to elect into a um, special class, if you will. Um, and so just part of that piece of thinking about maybe just keep it pure for the middle and high school components where electives actually are. A task force will go over the proposals on Thursday. The committee will go over those and the superintendent's proposals and give its recommendations by the end of June. In Billings, David J, MTN News.